Good evening, America. Thank you so much for joining me, judges. When I was in college, the go-to prank would be that you'd sneak into a friend's kitchen and you'd take their canned food, and then you'd remove all the labels so they had no idea what they were opening for dinner, whether it was oranges or maybe garbanzo bees or chickpeas, Simon, or maybe even pet food. Um, Simon, on your desk there, there's a blindfold. Will you just check for me that you can't see through it? It's completely opaque. There's no way to see. Yeah, I can't see anything. Wonderful. I'll take that from you, <laughs> and I'm going to leave this can with you. Thank Judges, you. behind you, AGT were kind enough to buy me 2,000 cans of every type of food. So in a second, I'm going to have you spread out, each grab a can, and then stand behind one of these bowls. So you'll have five seconds to do that, so that you don't feel like I'm watching you. I'm going to pop this blindfold on and stand over here. So you'll have five seconds to go and do that. So, go. Five, four, come on everyone. Three, two, one. Okay. Hopefully you're all stood behind the bowls now. If you want to open up your cans so that you can see nice and clearly inside, it's going to be my job to psychically link with you and describe what's in those cans. So we'll start, we'll start with you, Howie. Before I read your mind, it's only polite if we get to know you a little better. So um, what's your favorite thing to eat in the world ever? Rugula. Rugula? Mm -hmm. Delicious. Um, and obviously, um, obviously Rugula isn't in that, that can. Um, but there is chopped tomatoes. Pour out the chopped tomatoes. Show everyone what you've got. I'm taking from that warm reaction. That was correct. Good. Um, OK, we'll move on to you, Heidi. Uh, again, get to know you a little better. Um, Heidi, is there a meal that you love eating in Germany that you just can't get in the US? Yes. What is it? I love sauerkraut soup. Sauerkraut soup? Uh -huh. Oh, OK. I've never had sauerkraut in a soup. Um, but obviously, um, in, in England, when we do have sauerkraut, we like to top it with a corn, which is why that you've got that in your can. Pour it out, show everyone the corn. Wow, yes. Wonderful. Yes. And now finally, Sophia. Um, what's, what's a meal that your mum cooks better than anyone else in the world? Mm, arroz con coco. Co coconut rice. Coconut rice, perfect. Thank you for translating for me. I, I'm an idiot. Um, and I imagine a small twist on your mum's coconut rice would be uh, to put black beans with it. Um, pour out the black beans from your can. I have black beans. You have black beans, perfect, yes, excellent. Kidding. Thank you so much, judges. You can return to your seat, but Sophia, stay with me. In fact, um, come and join me at the table here. We've got something extra but for you. I don't want to try the beans. No, you don't have to try the beans, don't worry. We've, we've, got, we've got a special meal for you. Yeah, t t no, take a seat, take a seat. Um, because we shared a special moment in my first audition, so I thought it's only fair if we have a little dinner date. Um, so I've brought four cans here, and they are... Um, I, I brought them from home, from England. So let me tell you what's inside the cans. OK. In one of them is my favourite food to eat in the world ever, pineapple. And then the other three is a British delicacy. Simon will know this. Um, it's called brawn. Uh, for those of you unfamiliar, it's the offcuts of a pig's face. So it's the eyelids, the ears, the gristle, all set into a savoury gelatin. So that's what's in the other three. So in a second, we're going to select one, and you're going to eat what's inside. And why do I have to be the one punished? Uh, you're not going to be punished. Don't worry. You, you're not going to choose the cans. Don't, don't worry. Simon's going to choose the cans. No. <laughs> So, Simon, you can see that we have four coloured cans here. In a second, you're going to say the colour that you want Sophia to eat from. So change your mind a few times. Don't say anything just yet, but get a colour in mind. Do you have one in mind? Yep. Yes. But wait, you... think more, think more. <laughs> Do you want to change your mind? Sophia's worried. Do you want to change your mind? OK, I've got yellow in my mind. Yellow. OK, so you, you want to stick with yellow. So no, I don't. You've chosen the yellow can. No, so I'm going to change. You want to change? Yeah, I'm going to change it to black. You want to change it to black? Yeah. Excellent, OK. No, Hi. no, I'm going to change it to blue. A decisive man, we like this. You're going to change it to blue. Are you yeah. happy with blue? Yeah. I don't want to no, I'm going to go back to yellow. You're going to go back? I don't want to eat the pork. Don't worry, don't worry. Trust me, I, Sophia, I wouldn't be doing this if I wasn't 100% certain I could, convince, I could read Simon's oh, mind. OK. Well, 80% anyway. So you're sticking with yellow. 
No, blue. Blue. Excellent. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll make this decision easier for you. We'll eliminate the red can to start off with. So let's why have a look me, what was in. Why me always? <laughs> let's have a look what's in the red can, and that is um, some some brawn there. Would you like a little smell, Sophia? No, you said that you were not going to give me that. No, that's fine. You don't have to eat that. Um, so you wanted the blue can, Simon. So you didn't want the black can. You almost chose it. You changed your mind. Let's see what's in the black can. There's some more, no. some more brawn. No, that Still, looks even worse. It looks even worse. OK, so you've gone with the blue can. You went yellow, blue, yellow, blue. I'm going to give you one last chance to change your mind, Simon. You'll have three seconds, and then the color you say will be the final change, OK? No more changing. Three, two, one. Which can Sophia going to eat from? Yellow. yellow. The yellow can. OK, Sophia, you're going to eat from the yellow can. But I don't want you to see what's in it just yet. So will you grab the blindfold that's on the table in front of you? And give her a massive round of applause. What am I going to do? I put it now. Yep, yeah, put it on. Put the blindfold on so that you can't see. No spoilers here. I mean, but I don't understand why it always has to be me. <laughs> <laughs> and then, Sophia, there's a fork in front of you as well on the table. Just to your right, right a little bit. Right, uh, right a little bit more. There we are. Will you grab the fork and hold it prong side down, so like you're about to stab something. Prong side down. There we are. Um, and now I want you just to hold out your hand. Uh, and I'm just going to, over here, there we are. Stab down nice and hard. And in a second, I'm going to say go. Yeah, uh, nice and hard, like, like it's Simon. Like yeah, but it's Simon. it feels hot. It feels like gooey. It, it feels gross. OK, when I say now, I want you to take what's ever on the fork and eat it, OK? No touching, no cheating. Whatever's on the fork, you have to trust me. I'm just going to touch a little bit here. Touch a little bit here. Does it feel gross? Let's see. Three, two, eat what's on the fork to here. I One. Pineapple, excellent. And in case you're wondering, thank you so much for changing your mind, Simon. Sophia, you can take the blindfold off, that's fine. Oh. In the last can, there was more brawn. Yeah. Well done, Simon. Sophia, thank you so much for trusting me. It's delicious. It's, it's delicious. delicious. Then there you can have that. Um, but also, Simon, at the start, I left a can with you. Um, and obviously, we get to know the judges a little better. And that can's actually special uh, because it doesn't have food in it. What it has in it is a piece of paper. That I sealed up there earlier. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and Simon, I want you just to read that piece of paper out to everyone in the audience. I stay here. You stay here. You can enjoy the pineapple, Sophia. <laughs> out loud for everyone, Simon. Read you want out that to read piece of paper. this out? Yes, please. For my psychic menu, I'd serve Howie his favorite rugula. Heidi's most missed food, sauerkraut soup, <laughs> and Sophia Mum's speciality, coconut rice. Wow. Thank you so much, judges. That's why you can't prank a psychic. I've been Peter Antonio. Thank you. Good night. Peter Antonio. So